hi guys so if you are stuck in verifying update message on your iPhone so here's the fix the very first fix is force restarting your iPhone so what you have to do you have to press the power volume up button once and then down button once and after that just press the right side key and keep it pressed until the phone reboots and your Apple logo appears on the screen so let's do it press volume up once down once and then keep it pressed do not worry and it will restart and after that Apple logo will appear on the screen until then you have to keep it pressed okay so this you have successfully forcefully restarted your iPhone and now try again and see whether your problem fixes or not if this does not get fixed there is one more thing which you can do and that is just you know switching to your mobile data so if you are using Wi-Fi just turn off the Wi-Fi and try again and uh, try using your mobile data let's move to method free if this does not work what you can do you can go to settings okay now in the settings you have to go to general now go to iPhone storage okay and now scroll down and you can find iPhone update okay so if you can find an iPhone update in this list just click on it and delete the iPhone update okay in my case it is not there but in your case it will be there so just if you get any iPhone software update or iPhone update just go there and delete that iPhone update now try again try going to the you know general and software update again and then try you know downloading the update again now if this also does not work what you can do you can try you know using uh, connecting your computer through a USB cable to uh, to your phone and then download and install iTunes on your computer and from there you know once you will connect your phone to your computer from there just download update okay now if this also does not work let's move to the last method and that is resetting all network settings so just go to settings once again and now go to general and now go to transfer or reset iPhone and now click on reset and now click on reset network settings sorry now click on reset click on reset network settings enter your passcode if it wants and now finally click on reset network settings and it will reset and now try again and your problem will be fixed so that's it guys please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the geek page